please have one of your students come up to the smart board for the very first problem. Please remember to save this video first on your computer, then open it up with Smart Video Player. Thank you. Okay, boys and girls, we're looking at regrouping again, video three, and we have several problems for you. Let's look at the first problem. You'll notice that we have numbers at the top and the same numbers at the bottom. You provide us with the work at the bottom, and we will provide you with the answers at the top. But let me give you an example on the first one. We have 28 plus 6. We have two tens, and we have eight ones plus six ones. Now remember how this works. Six and eight is how much? 14. So we have one ten, which we'll place right here in the balloon, and we have a four, which we'll put right over here to the right. Now the four is in the elevator, so it comes down and over to the left, and we'll place a four right here. And the balloon goes up, over for regrouping and moves that 10 over here. So now we have how many 10s? 1, 2, 3. So our answer should be 34. Okay, what I would like for you to do is to pick up a pen and I would like for you to do this problem as well as this one. When you place the pen back in the tray, the video will pause and we will provide you with the answer. Thank you. Okay, hopefully you have the same answers we do up here. Let's look at this one. We have three tens and nine ones plus eight ones. Thirty-nine plus eight. Let's make this very simple. Nine plus eight is how much? If you said 17, you are right. Let's put a one in the balloon and let's place a seven over here on the elevator. As you know, the 7 goes down and over to the left. So we put a 7 right here, and the balloon goes up, slides over, and we now have an extra 10. So how many 10s do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4. So your answer should have been 47. If your answer matches ours, that is terrific. If you would, please have another student come up to the smart board and... While they're coming up for the next problem, if you would pick up your eraser and erase your answers. Thank you. Okay, boys and girls, here we are. Problem two. You provide the answers at the bottom. Please pick up a pen. The video pauses. When you're done, place the pen back in the tray and we will provide you with the answer at the top. Please pick up a pen now. Okay, let's see what we have here for the first one. 7 plus 7 is 14. We place a 10 in the balloon and a 4 over here in the elevator. And it goes down and over to the left, as we know, and we now have a 4 down here. The balloon goes up and to the left for regrouping, and we now have an extra 10. So we have how many 10s? 5 and 1 is 6. So the answer is 64. 57 plus 7 is 64. Let's look at the other problem. We have a 7 and a 9 in our 1s column. 9 and 7 is 16. So we have a 10 and we also have a 6. Elevator, and it comes down, goes to the left, and goes right in here. There's the elevator. And the 1, which is in a balloon, goes up, and comes all the way over here for regrouping, and lands right here. So how many 10s do we have? 1, 2. So we have two 10s and a 6 1s. So the answer is 26. Very good. If your answer matches ours, that is amazing. If you would, please have another student come up to the smart board. And while they're coming up, if you would please pick up an eraser and erase your answers.
Thank you. Okay, boys and girls, problem three. Just as before, pick up a pen and answer the questions at the bottom for these two problems. Please pick up a pen now. When done, place it in the tray. Okay, let's see what we have here. 9 and 8 is how much? 17. 17 means we have an extra 10, and we'll place a 7 in the elevator. The elevator goes down and to the left, so we put a 7 right here. The 1 goes up in the balloon all the way to the left and floats right here for regrouping. 8 and 1 is what? 9. So our answer is 97. 88 plus 9 is 97. Let's look at the other problem. Here we have 66 plus 5. 6 and 5 is what? 11. So that gives us a 10, which goes in the balloon, and a, a unit, or a 1, which goes right here. Elevator goes down and to the left, so we put a 1 right here, and the balloon goes up and to the left, and that gives us an extra 10. So we have 6 and 1 is 7. So the answer is 71. 66 plus 5 is 71. If your answer matches ours, that is truly fantastic. If you would please, have another student come up to the smart board. And while they're coming up, if you would pick up your eraser and erase your answers. Thank you. Okay, gang, here we are. Problem four. This one you're going to need your thinking gap. Let's look at the two problems at the bottom. We have 37 plus 2, and we have 66 plus 7. Tricky. Please pick up a pen and provide us with the answer. When done, place the pen back in the tray. Okay, let's look at the first one. We have three tens and seven ones. Thirty-seven plus two. Seven, eight, nine. Uh-oh. Seven, eight, nine. We're not going to have another ten. So we're only going to have the number nine. Now we can do one of two things. We can place the nine on the elevator. Let's do that. Or we could have just moved it down. So there's nothing in the balloon. So the nine goes down here and to the left. We're going to be consistent. Okay, there's our 9. Now, there is no extra 10, so we just simply have a 3. So you bring the 3 down. So that we really do not have regrouping on this one, do we? So 37 plus 2 is 39. Hopefully we didn't trick you too much. Let's look at the last one. 6 and 7. 66 plus 7. 6 and 7 is how much? 13. Oh, here we go. We have a 10, and we have three ones, don't we? So let's bring the 3 down in our elevator and put it right here. The extra 10 floats up all the way to the left and comes right here. So we have how many 10s? 6 and 1 is 7. So we put a 7 right here. 66 plus 7 equals 73. Hopefully yours looks just like ours. Very good. Please pick up an eraser and erase the screen. Super job, boys and girls. That was the last problem for today. It was great working with you. And thank you. Bye.